Problem? This is Thai food. Here we go. We don't have Thai food on Thursday. We have pizza on Thursday. Yes, but we all agreed that the third Thursday of every month would be anything can happen Thursday. Well, apparently the news didn't reach my digestive system, which when startled has its own version of anything can happen Thursday. Come on, the whole idea behind anything can happen Thursday is to get out of this rut we've been in lately. Rut? I think you mean consistency. And if we're going to abandon that, then why even call it Thursday? Let's call it Quanko Day and divide it into 29 hours of 17 minutes apiece and celebrate it by sacrificing a goat to the mighty god Ra. I could go for some goat. Sheldon, we agreed we'd do something different tonight. All right. Let's go to the comic book store. We went to the comic book store last night. Yeah, last night was Wednesday. Wednesday is comic book night. Tonight, we'll be going on Thursday because it's anything can happen Thursday. <laughs> Way to think outside, but pressed right up against the box, Sheldon. So what are we gonna do tonight? Well, if I may proffer a suggestion, in bars all across this great nation of ours, Thursday night is ladies' night. <laughs> Which means, as the evening progresses, we will get better looking, courtesy of 99-cent margaritas and two-for-one jello shots. Come on, Howard. The odds of us picking up girls in a bar are practically zero. Oh, uh, really? Are you familiar with the Drake equation? The one that estimates the odds of making contact with extraterrestrials by calculating the product of an increasingly restrictive series of fractional values, such as those stars with planets and those planets likely to develop life. N equals R times FP times NE times FL times FI times FC times L. <laughs> You can modify it to calculate our chances of having sex by changing the formula to use the number of single women in Los Angeles, the number of those who might find us attractive, and what I call the Wallowitz coefficient. The Wallowitz coefficient? Neediness times dress size squared. In crunching the numbers, I come up with a conservative 5,812 potential sex partners within a 40-mile radius. You're joking. I'm a horny engineer, Leonard. I never joke about math or sex. <laughs> well, what are we waiting for? Let's bounce, bitches. <laughs> oh, you're right. It's anything can happen Thursday. Let's hit the clubs and meet hot women. Here we go. Lock up your daughters. We're gonna hit it and quit it. <laughs> Or we could finish eating and go to the comic book store. <laughs> also a good plan. <laughs> All right, but next anything can happen Thursday, we're definitely going to a bar. Oh, absolutely. You heard that, ladies night, ladies? We're eventually coming for you. <laughs> Fascinating.